Next up are the Central Arkansas Bears, who will compete in their second full season here in the ASUN Conference. Coach Anthony Boone is going to lean heavily on former ASUN Freshman of the Year Cameron Hunter, who led the team last year and was also 10th in the conference with 14 points scored per game last season. Let's hear from Coach Boone and Cameron Hunter. Well, I certainly thought it was possible when Kim arrived. Um, I thought it was very probable after he was here for a few weeks. Uh, he, he came in certainly physically ready for the college game. Most people coming out of high school are, are not that um, physically gifted. And he certainly had a college, bo college body um, when he came in. And his work ethic uh, certainly proved that he was capable of a, a heavy workload and he works really hard and uh, really worked at it. And, and as he, uh, he emerged very quickly as one of our best players, if not our best player, uh, I certainly thought that he would end up being in the, in the race for freshman of the year in the conference. Even not knowing who all the freshmen were, I, I thought he would have a really good chance of being freshman of the year uh, pretty, pretty quickly. Well, I thought that last year we did a pretty good job of changing ends. And uh, I think that we have the capability of doing that even better, even better this year uh, with, a, with a pretty good returning group having a better understanding of each other, uh, them having a better understanding of me and me having a better understanding of them uh, and, and them understanding what it takes to compete in the A-Sun. Uh, I, I think that's gonna be our biggest strength, being able to change ends offensively and, and defensively. Uh, we did a great job of that last year. Uh, one of the best in the country, I think, in pace of play. I think we'll be able to improve on that this year and have a chance of being more competitive. If I had to say something, it'd probably be um, just understanding my teammates better because certain players operate, each player has a different way that they operate. Like certain players shoot better than other players and certain players are most successful in this spot and things like that. And criticism, how I could approach certain players because I'm growing to a leadership role this year. And I think that's the biggest aspect for me is just helping my teammates be successful, successful so we can have the whole team be successful at the end of the day. Um, biggest improvement for my team, I want to say, we made some good improvements this summer. I would probably want to say just mental toughness. I feel like that's the biggest part of the game is being able to be mentally tough when you're tired, long drive, like long possessions when offense, the other team has got most offensive rebounds. Can we finish plays? Can we remember our assignments late in the game? Double OT, can we be able to still do the things that Coach Boone wants to do even when we're tired and our body's wearing out, but can we stay mentally sharp? And then personally for me, I just want to I say probably just be more like be more assertive so far as vocally and mentally, because I feel like that's the biggest part. Like, yes, I can do it physically, but that's not a question. But mentally, I want to be able to just people know that regardless how I'm feeling, what might be wrong, I'm going to be there mentally and physically. And I think that's what I feel like that's what it, I expect for myself this upcoming year. The Bears had an incredible start in their first year in the A-Sun, reaching the A-Sun Championship quarterfinals. Cameron Hunter was a standout athlete, the first UCA athlete to be named Freshman of the Year. And the Bears were disciplined at the charity stripe, sporting the A-Sun's highest percentage at 76.1. This year, UCA opens up their season on the road in the Roundhouse at Wichita State November 7th. They open up at home November 11th versus Hendricks in Conway, Arkansas. 